Uh, wow. That is gorgeous. The only thing that stays consistent is the grind. Welcome back to the channel, everybody. Well, I should be welcoming myself back. Awesome subscribers of this channel say, Joe, thank you so much for being so consistent on this channel, posting videos about jewelry, getting to our requests and all that stuff. Guys, That after I got those comments, I didn't make a video for, I, I wanna say it's been over two weeks. Over two weeks, because if, if you checked out the last video that I put up, my wife has been ill, her grandparents have been ill, Everybody has not been doing too well today, but I'm glad to say that I have enough time today in order to get out a video And so I'm really really happy to be able to do that Just so happened that Dennis from Luke Zion Jewelry reached out to me only a couple of days ago And he said Joe would you like me to send you another chain and I said absolutely Please send me some more of that ice that you hold in your hands Please send that over to me. So as you noticed in the beginning of the video guys we have a Valentino link on this channel. Now that's not by accident. That's because one of the fantastic subscribers reached out and said, Joe, can you cover the Valentino link? And I happen to know that Dennis has some really beautiful Valentinos over there. So I reached out to him and I said, would you mind sending one our way? He said, absolutely. That's what we have to look at today. But in the meantime, guys, you'd be surprised at how many people leave comments on the channel asking what my daily stack is. Uh, despite the fact that I've been running around like crazy, hospitals, doctors, I typically have my stack on, and that is, these days, an accumulation of a couple of chains. We have the Luke Zion in the middle. That's the dollar chain, looking like ice, pure ice, looking like white gold, to be honest, not even looking like silver. Then we have a concave curb over here at five and a half, uh, excuse me, at five millimeters. And then we have a five and a half millimeter flat curb. The dollar link chain is also at five millimeters. So we have 15 and a half millimeters hanging around the neck all at 20 inches. Now the reason why I wear them all at 20 inches, you guys might be familiar with with what I've mentioned in the past, but if you're not, I like them all hanging out at 20 inches because that is going to give the illusion of a really fat chain. Now I just realized I don't have a black shirt on. Hopefully you guys are able to see, but this is going to give the illusion of a really fat chain, 15 and a half millimeters. Now think about how much a 15 and a half millimeter Cuban might cost you, right? At 20 inches, you wouldn't even want one at 20 inches because you probably want it to be a little bit lo lower because those are some fat links, but you know, that's all personal preference. But just imagine how much one of those would cost. It would be absurd, absurdly expensive when you downsize your millimeters in this fashion. Not only do you have more versatility, because you can rock one, you can rock two, or rock all three, but you also have the advantage of spending a lot less money. So 20 inches uh, long, 15 and a half inches thick. Love it, absolutely love the weight, really weighty. Now let's get into the Valentino. Okay, here is that Valentino, and I can see why the fantastic subscriber of this channel asked me to cover it. It is gorgeous. Let me just throw it on the hand here. I'm a little rusty because it's been a few weeks since I've done a video for you guys. Please forgive me. Sorry that I've been so busy. Let's hope this camera focuses. Oh, you know what I realized? I'm using a different lens than I normally use. So I'm gonna have to stand a little further away and zoom in so we can get a clear look. I was wondering why that was going on. Okay, so let's see. There we go. A little too far, a little too cool. There you go. Look at that. Check that out. Absolutely gorgeous. It's like a mirror. Look at that mirror finish. I mean, look at the way the light hits that. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Now, this particular chain is at 22 inches. 
I've mentioned a million times, I like the 20 inch for me. I'm 5'6". By the way, guys, I'm 160 pounds. So I've gained some weight since I've last saw you guys. That's what happens when you're running around. Running around not eating right, busy with doing, doing stuff. This chain not only looks like ice, it looks like glass, it looks like everything smooth and shiny. Amazing, absolutely beautiful. Okay, so around the neck we have the 22 inch, which I'm actually feeling I really do like uh, the 22 inch, the 22 inch Valentino from Luke Zion. I wish I remembered to put on that other lens, but that's okay. We'll deal with this a little bit of different move today. Look at the way that light hits this thing. This thing is not looking like silver, guys, even with the dollar chain, as I showed you in that previous video when I covered it. This is looking like a straight up white gold chain. It is absolutely beautiful. And man, I am super happy that you sent it my way. Um, absolutely fantastic. I hope that you guys look into this. If you haven't already, it's like a mirror. Beautiful finish, very, very bright. The one thing that I'm gonna caution you guys with, and you may be able to see it on camera, even though it's looking super icy right now, Okay, and we're going to look at it from 12 feet back like we normally do. Hopefully this shirt won't throw it off too much. If it does, I'll always do, I can do another video on it. I'm sure this will not be the last time that somebody asked me to see this Valentino. Um, but one thing I would caution you with is because of the mirror finish, when you put this thing on, you're going to want to make sure that you don't touch it too much. Okay, now look at that. Oh, beautiful. Look at the way the, the light hits that. It's got diamond cuts on it. Diamond cuts on the side. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Those diamond cuts flicker really, really nicely. And uh, the what? But again, because it's a mirror finish, you want to make sure your fingers aren't touching them too much, touching the links too much, because you could potentially get some fingerprints. If it's got a good polish on it, which it does, super, super clean, you can just wipe them off. But of course you wanna to try to avoid it altogether, right? Now again, I have a yellow shirt on. I was so happy and eager to throw this video out that I didn't change my shirt. Let me know if you need me to change my shirt. Let me know if you need me to throw another video out on this. And I will absolutely do that no problem there. I will be looking for excuses to wear this chain. It is it is beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. A little long for my taste uh, at the 22 inch length, but that's okay. It's nice. It's a nice change. It really is a nice change. But as I see myself in it, I realize I definitely like the 20 inch for me. I just feel like I'm too short to rock a 22, but that's personal. That's completely personal, that's completely because of me. Anyway guys, I hope that you are all doing well. I hope your families are doing well. And I wanna thank you all for the support that you guys give to me, not only because of the content for the channel, you guys support me all the time with the channel, but I'm talking about the, the support that you guys reached out to me about when I mentioned how my wife wasn't well and how her grandparents weren't well, you guys, came to the comments and you you wished me the best and that means more than you guys know. So thank you so much for that. I'm gonna to try to get out my videos. I'm gonna to try to get back to being consistent. Every single day I'm gonna to try to drop at least one video. That's what I'm gonna to try to do again moving forward like I was doing. If not, please forgive me. Something else that happened. All my requests got deleted off my phone. All my requests got deleted. I ended up finding them. I'm going to be trying to get them out systematically, so please forgive me, it might take a little while, but if I happen to uh, not hit your request, and it's been a long time, resend me the request so that I know what your request was in case for some reason that one stayed deleted, okay? Be safe, catch you all at the next video, and stay healthy everybody. Talk soon.